Hey everyone, it's Marissa here, and I want to show you what I picked up this weekend, and I think I scored big time. Um, I went to, Saturday morning, I went to a garage sale, and then today I went to the thrift store and the antique mall. So I'm going to go ahead and show you what I got from the yard sale. Um, I didn't pick up too much, but I did pick up, you know, full, a few cool things. So the first thing I picked up was this super cute Hello Kitty wallet. And the girl that um, was selling this had a whole bunch of other Hello Kitty wallets. I guess she loved Hello Kitty, but she had a whole bunch of wallets and purses, matching purses. And they're all for a dollar, but um, I like this one the most. Um, so it, you open it up and it has all, you know, the pocket for your cash and then your ID and you know and then a little coin thing so I got that for a dollar from one yard sale and then I thought this was cool this was a dollar and it's like an old box and then it's like a not a Rolodex but like an old oh shoot Oh, anyways, it has these old tabs, these um, letter tabs here with some of these blank cards. So I'm going to redo it and then I can put the addresses for my YouTube friends in here. So I picked that up. And then I also got this really cool, this was a dollar, and it's called Follow the Dot Stamps. Um, and I guess you stamp it and then you um, can trace it so my three-year-old is in preschool and um, she's learning how to write so I thought this would be so cool to work with her at home because she loves to draw and color and all the um, letters are here so they've been used but it's okay because they're still in good condition so that was a dollar I picked that up and then the last thing I picked up from one of the yard sales I'm going to move you is this right here and this is about, I think I paid $2 for this. So it's like a metal, it's kind of like this wooden one that I picked up, but it's a metal one. Um, and it's kind of big. I'm going to spray paint it, of course, because the green, you know, is not my thing. But um, I thought that that was cool. And it's funny because I, when I went to the thrift store this morning, or not the thrift store, but the antique mall, those things were going for like, almost a hundred bucks if not more so I think I scored on that and I'm gonna put um, you know some embellishments in there if you guys are wondering what I'm gonna do with that big old thing so got that and then um, from the thrift store I was able to pick up some cool pieces um, for really good price because normally people think oh you know and the antique mall or whatever is so overpriced but you just gotta like I don't know I just happened to go at the right time and um, I just have good luck finding things I don't know but there I mean don't get me wrong there are a lot of things that are expensive but you just got to look around because um, I looked around and found some things for a good price so I found this big old thing of pink tool and this was only two bucks and I love the color the pink is just so pretty so I got that and then um, I found this bag of lace, and I think this was like um, $8, but if you guys have been to the antique mall, they have like, um, inside the, the stores, they have little booths, and um, there's different owners that own the little booths, and this particular one was 20% off of the 8 bucks. So, and I thought that was pretty good for this type of lace because you guys know that this is really, really good lace. So that's why I picked it up. So six bucks was awesome for this type of lace. Look how gorgeous that is. And it's all of this. So I think that was good. Look at how cute. It's like crochet lace. So I picked that up. And then I found um, this super cute crochet heart it's hard to find these because um, a lot of times that I the times that I've seen these they're really expensive so but this one wasn't that I think this one was like two dollars so I picked up that one and then I also picked this one up which I'm going to cut up so 
So I thought this one was cool, and this was like a dollar fifty, I believe. So I picked that up. I found a um, salt and pepper shaker, and this was like twenty percent off, but they took off the tag, and I don't remember. It was like a dollar fifty or something for that. And then this was twenty percent off, and this was I think marked three dollars. So I got the twenty percent off of that, and I want to alter this. So. Pick that cute little teacup up. Found these. These are gorgeous. So pretty. Look at that. So I'm going to use those as flower centers. They are so pretty. Got that. And then I found this Fenton piece. Oh my gosh, it's so pretty. Look at how cute that is. And it has the sticker on it. And it says Authentic Fenton Handmade. Thought this would be a great addition because you guys know I love this type of a milk glass. So I picked up that, of course. This wasn't as cheap as I would like it to be, but it was still cheaper than the norm whenever I go and see that. And then I was also able to find some milk glass. So I found this one, and I think this one was like eight dollars. And then the 20% off of this, and this was like four bucks with the 20% off. So that's what I picked up from the antique mall and if you guys you guys go ahead and go um, look at my last video because I did a quick um, video of um, what it looks like so you guys can get an idea of um, where I go sometimes on the weekend okay so after that I went to Savers I found this bag of um, really cute um, picture frames to alter and let me try to open this up these are really cute I like the um the frame it's plastic so it's really light so I like the um the design on here but I'm gonna probably paint that so I did pick that up for dollar ninety nine and there's four of them and then this one yes baby Yes, I'm okay. Thank you. you Want to say hi? Say hi, YouTube. Hi, YouTube. Okay, go back inside the house. Okay. Okay, and then you guys are never gonna believe what I got. Okay, so I found this really pretty, gorgeous heart, and I found two of them. So got that one. Found lots of lace, you guys. You guys are not going to believe how much bundles of lace. And I'm so glad I went because I wasn't going to go because I was tired. And so this is all the lace, you guys, that I found. And they're all cream color. Look, yum, 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 yum. <laughs> so um, I'm going to go quickly through the bags because some of the laces are different and some of them are the same. So this bag is like a crochet trim and it's super pretty. I don't have anything like this, this big. So I got this one. And then this one has, I believe, two different types of laces in here. Super cute. This one's really soft and pretty. There's this one and that one. And then this one has different laces in here too. And this, I love this one. I saw this, I was like, oh, I have to get it. I can't leave it behind. So this one is super cute. As you, you guys know I love the scallop edges on um, lace. So that had that one in there. It had this. And it had this really dainty one. And as you guys can see, it's not like a yard, two yards, or three yards. It's a lot of yards. So, I will be sending some of these in racks and whatnot. So, got that one. And this was the only one that wasn't cream. And this, has, this one has several different laces in here as well. So, there's this one. This is really pretty that one and then I like this one too look at how pretty this one is see the edges on it so that one and then it has 
and this one. That one. So that's that one. And then this one has this really pretty small lace. And look, it's this whole bag. So I got that. Got this one. Has different laces. This is pretty. This is like a pleated lace. This is a um, bigger lace. And then this one is cute. There's this. And I think that's the only type of lace in this one. And then this one's a bigger lace. Still can use that. This one. That. And then the last bag that I have here um, is one type of lace. And it's really pretty. I like this one too. And it looks like that. So that's all that gorgeous lace that I picked up from Savers today. I was super happy. Because I haven't been able to find a lot of laces there lately. So I hope you guys enjoyed my video. Um, please comment below. If you guys haven't, um, check out my 2000 subby giveaway. Um, I will link it down below in the description box. Um, and thanks for watching. Bye.